Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and uh, today we are going to unbox this. So this is a Nissan Skyline H-T 2000 GTX and this is by Hot Wheels from the Ultra Hot series. Bought it for MRP 299 and uh, let's unbox this and see how this one looks. So, so far I liked whatever I unboxed, you know, the past two, specifically the Dodge, which has an openable part, which, which is really nice in my opinion, for the price, finally Mattel did something right, but let's see on this, okay, so, the initial impressions of this car, it's like, it looks good, okay, this one, you can feel the issues in the paint, paint job here, especially, you know, on the roof there are no openable parts so they painted these things you know a little bit different but it has some paint on headlights and taillights as well okay but the worst thing is this part is not metal the chassis is not metal in this one this is actually just plastic and uh, i am really hating this one you know because see you are paying 300 rupees not for uh, full plastic again so the rest two are made of metal so they could have just gone with metal chassis on this one but they didn't do my in my opinion this could have been placed somewhere around you know on the main lines like 180 but not more than that so the paint job itself is you know see the paint job the paint color is nice but the way they painted it it is not good i can see a lot of irregularities here at least they could have went with metal you know for the chassis so so far you know whatever we unboxed you know i saw all the rims are same for the ultra hot series you know i'm not sure about the older ultra hot series because you know it's never been in india at least from the time i started collecting so if any of you guys you know collected ultra hearts before you know i'm talking about during uh, around 2010 or 2015 before it got banned just let me know in the comments if this is the same way they used to do all these things so i'm honestly not having any clue so there is some extra de exhaust detail here which is good but it's a okay casting i'm not going to say it is very good and all so, so they could have just added a metal chassis okay does look nice but still for the price we are paying i am expecting more nothing much okay, let's do a roll test real quick Okay, here it is. Okay, this doesn't roll really well as well. As you can see, you know, you can hear that noise and it is not smooth or fast rolling as the other two. So see, my doubt is, you know, just because they have a plastic chassis, you see, if it is a metal chassis, the weight will be, you know, pulling down the car due to the gravitational force. So which will give you a sense of balance. So this one doesn't have that because only the body is made of metal, right? Like the other main lines. So that is my uh, theory, as you can see. Because, you know, if the weight is more, it will hold down that uh, wheels properly to the ground. But here it is not happening. So that's it for today, guys. If you like my video, hit the thumbs up button. If you like my video, subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching this video. Have a great day. Goodbye.